to remain calm, cool, and collected. Got a seat there. one point that we had more energy to do all the things that we want to do. Yet with such busy lives and so many opportunities out there, it's no wonder the world spends billions of dollars on coffee and energy drinks to give us that extra boost. The problem with that is these substances can actually be harmful to our health and our bodies long term and they don't provide sustainable long term energy. Take it from someone who used to drink loads of energy drinks and multiple cups of coffee a day to keep me going. I eventually fell sick and burnt out because it was just not sustainable for me. I don't even know what is in those energy drinks but it really did make me feel crazy. Of course it took me until I really did not feel well in order to really look into ways that I can boost my energy levels to maintain productivity but also take care of myself and my health as well. In this video I'll share five quick tips you can use to boost your energy levels and maintain productivity. Remember with our busy lives we're always sacrificing our health and ourself in order to get things done for others but it's so important to actually take care of your health and yourself first and you'll be able to better take care of everything else in your life. As much as I like to be productive and get things done, I prioritize my health first because if you don't have your health, nothing else matters. You really need to take care of your health first and then everything else will fall into place. So let's go to my first tip for boosting your energy the healthy way. Our bodies can easily get dehydrated because of all the water that we lose throughout the day and most people wait until they're thirsty to drink water, yet that is too late. When you're thirsty, it means that your body's already dehydrated and when your body is dehydrated you become stressed out, anxious, fatigued, you lose your memory function and you just become very forgetful. So when you're dehydrated you just don't perform mentally or physically as well. That's why you need to make sure you hydrate regularly throughout the day even though you're not thirsty because you don't want to get to that point where you have low energy levels and you're stressed out, fatigued, and you just can't perform. These are preventive strategies to remain calm, cool, and collected by hydrating yourself with delicious water. That tastes so good. Got a seat there. All right. to improve both your mental and physical performance significantly. It's very hard to avoid stress and anxiety in our lives, yet stress and anxiety actually drain our minds and our bodies of energy. Meditation is a great way to reduce your stress and anxiety and maintain and sustain those energy levels. The stressed out brain and body loses energy much faster and that's when your motivation takes a dive. So think of your energy levels like the battery of your phone. When you have multiple applications running at once, your battery will drain very quickly. Meditation helps you maintain your battery life or energy levels 
by setting your mind and body on airplane mode. So no matter what applications, text messages, or phone calls are running at the time, you can still maintain your energy levels. So remember, just a short five to 10 minute meditation can help you refocus, relax, and boost your energy to keep you going throughout your day. Apples are actually a great source of fiber, vitamin C, antioxidants, and complex carbohydrates, which is why I love eating an apple to give you a quick, healthy energy boost. Apples contain four grams of fiber, which keep you feeling full and more energized for longer. It contains complex carbohydrates, which means it breaks down more slowly in your body so that you don't get that sugar crash as you would with either white bread or candy. Apples are one of my favorite fruits to eat and I actually try to eat an apple a day to keep the doctor away. It gives you energy and tastes delicious. you that same effect without the unwanted side effects. Mm, it's, a, it's a bit hot but always tastes good. because it improves circulation to increase the blood flow around your body and also to your mind. Remember, if your muscles are fatigued and tired, your mind will follow. So make sure your body is aligned and working as efficiently as possible in order for your mind to work. Stretching also increases flexibility. By lengthening tight muscles, we realign our bodies to work as efficiently as possible. Stretching improves circulation, increasing blood flow to the muscles and to the brain, making our bodies and our mind feeling more energized throughout the day. So those were my five quick tips to boost your energy and increase your productivity. I hope they were helpful. These are the healthiest ways I know how to boost my energy and get all the things I need to get done throughout my day. And I found them to be very sustainable and healthy. It's made me as efficient as possible and I hope that it can make you efficient and productive as well. I hope you enjoyed this video. I really look forward to making videos like this and helping you take care of your health and yourself. And I look forward to seeing you in the next video. Bye everyone.